Item number SCP-7800-J Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-7800-J Affected Foodstuffs too numerous to contain have been partially held within Site 77's brick room. No personnel have gone sick or died because of SCP-7800-J affected foodstuffs. Description SCP-7800-J is a phenomenon affecting foodstuffs which have been dropped with onto the floor. For approximately five seconds, all possible contaminant will not affect it. This miraculous phenomenon has been observed by researcher Boyd numerous times in the Site 77 staff brick room. It is not actually or that unusual to perform in practice. When activated, personnel surrounding SCP 7800J affected foodstuffs will react as if the researcher involved was eating from a trash receptacle, which he wasn't. Researchers are to note that there are more contaminants on the kitchen counter anyway. Personnel are also to note that use of SCP-7800-J saves the foundation time and money, which can be better spent on containment. Research done independently by Researcher Boyd shows that a temporal anomaly may occur where the length of the seconds will temporarily dilate, dependent on the hunger of the subject and the price of the food in question. Researcher Boyd has included a chart. Extraordinary Event 7800J17 The Gem Pepperoni's 5 Cheese Carol Song Incident is estimated to have saved Foundation staff at least $5.95. This $5.95 allowed for the purchase of cinnamon raisin bagels, which further served to improve the site morale. SCP-7800-J also served to protect site supplies from anomaly 5XJ9, but aside down. Addendum. Experimenters will admit that SCP-7800-J does not function properly when there are liquids involved, including sauces, but this has no bearing on Extraordinary Event 7800J17, because Researcher Boyd only took two bites and they were basically on the top. Incident Report SCP-7800-J has been shown to affect dirty dishes as well. Researcher Daryl Jacobs was carrying large amounts of dishes after he consumed a single bowl of soup and accidentally dropped them. Researcher Boyd managed to catch nine of the plates and then began to give them to Site 77's dog, Sparky, who successfully consumed the dropped foodstuffs without exploding or anything.